Hey, let me call you back. All right, bye. You ain't got to do that. You can stay on the phone. Please, I am not worried about you. Yeah, right. So how was your audition? I don't know, I think I got that part. Don't be so negative. You never know. Well, I don't look like genuine, so apparently I had the right look to be a black actor in Hollywood. <laughs> Correct, because you look nothing. I mean nothing. <laughs> nothing like genuine. But that shouldn't hold you back from making it, because there's a lot of ugly actors. You calling me ugly? Yes, but that's not the point. The point is, not everyone in Hollywood looks alike. You just have to find the role that's looking for someone with your look. Oh, I, I see your point. What was the role for? Genuine biopic. <laughs> okay, that's big. It was a major role, but I don't think I got it. I think I may audition for the wrong character. Uh, you auditioned for Magoo? Nah. Uh, one of the guys from Player? Who? You know. Cheers to you for giving me a chance. Oh, no. Nah. Nah. Missy? Hell no. Nah. <laughs> I went out for genuine. <laughs> Hold on, let me get this straight. If you're honey, this, that one, genuine. No, 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 no. Let me get this straight. You auditioned for a role in which they needed someone who looks exactly like genuine? Yeah, well, a young genuine. <laughs> Old, young, middle age, you look nothing like him. That's the same thing the director said. Yeah, you just need to audition for a role that's looking for someone who you look like. Like more shit nut? <laughs> no, I was thinking more like Benny Siegel. Oh, I see you got jokes. Very funny. <laughs> I see you got jokes today. I see it was time for a, a, a edge up. Man, shut up. You just mad because you ain't got no head to edge up. That's my beard, a cold days, just like you do. Shut up, I don't have a beard. Your mama got a beard. Your mama got two beards. Mom, that don't make no sense. How can my mom have two beards? As above and below you that bush. Nasty, nasty. Your mama nasty. You gonna stop talking about my mama. So, who do the name do you on the phone with? Okay, first of all, that's none of your business. And second, I never said it was a guy. He's not lame. I knew it was a guy. Okay, yeah, it was a guy, but he's just a friend. You like him, though. Yes, as a friend. You ain't got a lot of me. You can always tell when a woman's on the phone with a guy she likes versus a guy who's just a friend. And how is that? Because when the guy you're interested in calls you, you answer the phone all sweet-like. <laughs> hey, baby. How's it going? <laughs> now, when I call you, it's a whole different story. <laughs> what do you want? See what I mean? No, not at all. So, what you doing this weekend? Oh, man, I got a couple of holes coming over. We want to get now. Coming over where? Oh, they They're not going to come over. Hey, hey, guys! Hey! What's up, girl? Hey, where you about to go? Look at my recording like that. How about you guess where I'm about to go? I'm going to assume to the gym. Good guess. Gold star for you, Captain Obvious. She <laughs> just played me? I taught her so well. Hey, you know what? Y'all think I need to go ahead and do that. Maybe I need to work out, get all toned, get all fit, you know, kind of sexy. Then try out for a role. Maybe I have a big chance of getting that role. Steve, you can work out eight hours a day, seven days a week, and you still won't look like that man. <laughs> Hater. Okay, well, if you're serious, I can hook you up on my trainer. Yeah, do that. Okay, I hope you're serious, because uh, she's pretty tough. Hold on. Did she just say she? I did. Nah, in that case, I'm, I'm fine. I'll find a male trainer. What's that supposed to mean? It means I'm going to find a male trainer training because I'm a male. She trains men, too. Well, she wants to train in this male. What I look like? Do you really want me to answer that? Excuse me? <laughs> <laughs> Another good one. <laughs> Listen here, KP and Envy. Y'all better leave me the hell alone. Whatever. You know, shout is swinging my way. Nah, I never heard of that. 
I got so much work to do on you, girl. But back to you, Steve. Chanel looks good and fit, so whatever her trainer is doing, it's working. See? See what? Anyway, how can a female make me stronger by stronger than a female? Steve, you're not stronger than every female. Yes, I am. No, you're not. <laughs> she trains men with way more muscle than you got, buddy. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. What's that way more thing you're talking about? I, what's up with that? All I'm saying is I prefer a guy to train me, not a female. Well, that's fine. That sounds better than you saying you won't train with a woman just because she's a woman. Uh, I'm saying that too. <laughs> you can't say that. I just did. Men are physically, emotionally, and mentally stronger than all women. Well, like Eleanor Roosevelt said, a woman is like a tea bag. You never know how strong she is until you put her in hot water. <laughs> and like the great Proctor and Gamble said, strong enough for a man, but pH balance for a woman. Way to get them, Chanel. <laughs> Yo! What's up, people? What's up? Hey. All right, all right. Ask Sean how you feel about this. Ask Sean how you feel about what? Having a female personal trainer help you get in shape. Now, why would I do that? Unless all the male trainers fell off the face of the earth or something. Exactly. <laughs> What's that? What's the difference? Well, simple. Men are stronger than women. Bam! Like, what are you trying to say? Yeah, because both of y'all are idiots. Wait a minute. I know how to settle this. How about we have a competition? Call my trainer over, and she can train us here. I like that idea. We don't have no equipment here. She doesn't need equipment. She can work us out here. Well, it's it's a little too soon. I haven't prepared yet. I ain't stressed to none of that. Right, yet. and I just finished eating. Y'all ain't finna have me in here getting cramped up messing with y'all. Wait, it's mom, not happening. Mom's cook? A little something. I ain't bring me a plate. My bad, dog. You want me to get your plate? I go get your plate. Uh, right hold now. on, hold on, hold on. Where do you think you're going? Back to what we were just talking about. Ooh. Chanel, I think they scared. I'm feisty. Uh, Sean sounds scared, but uh, Steve sounds hungry. <laughs> she sounds hungry. Okay, so how about a friendly bet? The last woman or man standing wins for the gender. And what do we get if we win? What do you want? Well, since you asked, I mean... Uh, um, no. Okay, if you guys win, okay, we'll invite some of our single friends over, and you can have a little get-together, and you guys will be the only ones there. Yeah. I like that. Right, right. Dana, you got to invite your friend that's always on your page posting them low self-esteem quotes. You know it's sad that I know exactly who you're talking about. I bet you do. But I'll invite her. So, what do we get we should so happen to lose? Just so happen. What do you think, Chanel? Well, since Dana and I are going on a double date tonight, I think if you guys lose, you give us 50. And you give us 50. Oh, so you want to go the money route, huh? Mm. Okay. Well, you know it's not safe for a woman to go out without any cash on her. <laughs> I heard that before. Oh, oh. But but in, anyway, hold on. Let, let's recap. So if we win, right, we get a private party. Which private? With all your single friends. All of them. And they gotta be single, cause we gonna smash something. You I'm trying what? to tell you. And <laughs> if y'all win, we get y'all hundred cash. Fifty from you. Fifty from you. Boom. And how, how that sound to you? I don't know, dog. This is my thing. It ain't really no guarantees with a singles friends party, even with old girl with the low self esteem quotes. But a hundred is an easy guarantee for them. Well, since we are going to win, it's like a guarantee. Right. What the hell? I tell you what, dog. You with it to hell with it. I'm in. Great. I'm going to give her a call right now. You know y'all going to lose, right? Just make sure your friends is fine. But you're going to lose. I don't do booger bears well. I never have. Okay, guys. Can talk to her. Hey, this is my trainer. Well, damn. Hello, beautiful. Her name is Deb. Okay, Deb. <laughs> Are you guys ready to work, or are we here for social hour? We're ready to Man, work, cuz. All right, then let's go. As you can see, I'm already in shape. 
Uh, judging from my angle, it looks like you need to lose a few. What's that supposed to mean? It means move your ass. Give me Tina. Beyonce. Give me Janet. No, 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 not that Janet. Control Janet. Oh, yes. Run in place. Faster. I'm running, I'm running. Run off on the plug. I don't got no plugs. Now squat. Watch how I do them, then you do them. Lord, Jesus. Oh, yes, Lord. Yes, yes. <laughs> All right, Chanel, you know the routine. Walk the runway. Bring it back. There you go. Now work those arms and vote. There we go. Come on, bring it back. Vote. On the floor, give me 20. No, 20 push-ups, now! All right, damn. You're so aggressive. You need a boyfriend or something. Uh, one. You call that a push-up? Uh, yeah. This is a push-up. You see how my knees are not touching the ground? Well, I like using my knees, kind of like training wheels. And I appreciate it if you leave me alone while I beat your ass. <laughs>50 from me, yes. and 50 from Sean. Yes. Hold yeah. on, my 50 right here. Sean don't got 50. What you mean you don't got 50? You agreed to the bet. What I agreed to was that the women would be paid $100 from the men. Yeah. We didn't specify on how to be broke down, though. Well, one would assume we're splitting at 50-50. One would assume that one shouldn't assume. All I got is 10. All right, let me see that. Thank you. Great doing business with you. Uh, come on, let's go get ready. I can't stand y'all. Can't believe you, man. Dog, that's my fault, bro. What 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 can I do to make it up to you? You want a plate from Dukes? That's a good start, man. Cause I ain't got no money to eat. All right, then, man. Oh, no problem, dog. I got you. You you know I got you. I'll be right back. Hey, man, listen. I'm starving. Don't be all day. Dog, you always grabbing me, dog. God damn! I got you, dog. Just calm your bed. I'll be back. Ah, damn, that was fast. It's a lot. Come in, boy. I'm glad you came back, boy. I might have to whoop your ass. Who else you gonna whoop? Rose. Demon. <laughs> Demon? Demon? What the hell you doing here? It's D Money, man. And I'm here to see Dana. Dana, hold on. You on her date? Yeah. What? Where y'all going? Go ahead, go on there. <laughs> what y'all going to do? A little of this, a little of that. How long y'all been dating? Damn, first 48? But you gonna interrogate me, man, or you gonna offer me a seat, dog? I'm sorry. Go ahead, take a seat, man. Yo, dog, you gonna give me some room, man? My bad. A little bit. My bad. I'm sorry. Yeah. Nobody know how I feel about me not offering you the, the place. Nah, ain't, ain't no hard feelings, man. We good. We cool? Cool, man. Thank you, man. All the way cool. Thank yeah. you, man. You know? you know what I mean? I'm gonna be moving in, though, you know? After a while, though. Soon enough. <laughs> what you mean by that? Can you get that for me, please, Steve? Hey, Steve, go get that. What you mean by that comment? Do it, man. Oh, 
Come on, Darren. What's your name? Brad. Brad, how you doing? I'm assuming you're here for Chanel. Yeah. Ceiling room still changing. <laughs> uh, sit beside Demon, uh, D Money. She'll be out shortly. Right. Have a seat. <laughs> so, Brian, what do you do? I'm a model. I'm a model. At Walmart? Oh, bro. Darjay. <laughs> you know, Chanel model at Walmart, right? I know. I'm really trying to break some barriers with this date. I mean, us models, we're a minority. And we got to stick together, no matter who we pose for. Know what I mean? Hello. Ready? Hey. Last well, scene. Ah! Hey, baby. Bye. Have a nice night. I'm Stephanie Holloway. You want to watch some more of the threesome? Subscribe to that YouTube channel. Subscribe to our YouTube.